As a woman and somebody going into the healthcare field, I personally don't, it's on your opinion on abortion. Um, I personally don't think that like I could have an abortion just because morally I feel like for myself it wouldn't be the right choice. Um, but how do you defend your opinion as a white, well-off, religious man? Um, how do you defend your, ha like, telling a woman what she can do with because her body? Because evil things are still evil, even if I'm a white, well-off, religious man. And good things are still good, even if I'm a white, well-off, religious man. So the, I mean, to, this is, the, this is, this is one of these, this is one of these identity politics points that I really, uh, I mean, I, I don't mean to come down harshly on you, I don't, uh, but it, it is a point that I really have serious moral qualms with. I, I think it's quite, quite terrible. The reason being that the people who were fighting against enslavement of black people were a bunch of well-off white men for the most part. Right? And those people were saying, this is a moral sin. This is a moral blot. They weren't living in the South. They didn't own plantations. They didn't live the lives of the plantation owners. They said, this is evil, and we are here to stop it. Right? When you see something that you think is morally wrong happening, especially when you're talking about the taking of a human life, like, listen, I think that, uh, I think that you shouldn't go around randomly killing homeless people. I just have this view. I'm not a homeless person. Most of the people who randomly kill homeless people are probably not of my economic strata, my religious view, or my, uh, I don't know whether they're of my skin color or not. I have no idea what the, what the actual sociological breakdown of homeless killer serial murderers is, but, uh, but I would suggest that my identity has nothing to do with what is right or wrong. And this is what Western civilization used to be about. Western civilization used to be about the idea that, yes, I'm not a woman in the healthcare field, but you and I can have a conversation about what's right and wrong because this is the nature of human reason. The nature of human reason, the nature of right and wrong, is that you and I can talk about what's right and wrong and that I don't retreat into my identity. If we can all retreat into our identity and our morality is now centered around that identity, morality doesn't exist at all. We break down into a society of fragmented atoms where I can't even say, like, you're torturing a puppy in your backyard. I have nothing to say about that. I'm not a white woman who's in the healthcare field. I'm not going to do that. I don't, I don't, I, I refuse to surrender the idea that I can have a moral stance on issues that are of concern to society and of concern to the, to the well-being of the United States simply because of the color of my skin or the nature of my genitalia. And honestly, I believe any view that feels differently is sexist, racist, and bigoted.